Hi there, and welcome to Apple World. So it seems as though the federal authorities are going after Diddy's amigo Cuba Gooding Jr., since new proof just became known that demonstrates that not exclusively was Cuba and these free, however he likewise purportedly arranged, furthermore, drove the in light of the fact that he was similarly as freaky as did he was, while perhaps not more. We have known briefly now that Cuba doesn't precisely treat ladies with an entire parcel of regard. He certainly has some difficulty holding up certain limits. What's more, the subtleties that the federal authorities just delivered about him are wild, since it turns out that he was supposedly Diddy's right-hand man, and furthermore, had his own duplicates of their oddity off tape. Koopa is in a tough situation with the federal authorities, and it seems as though he is on the run since those RICO charges are coming for him quick. The little pole was the primary individual to tie Cuba Gooding Jr. to Didi, which he did in his claim that he recorded recently. Little Bar, however, allowed everything to out in his claim, saying that he lived with Diddy from September 22 to September 2023, while they were dealing with Diddy's affection collection, and during that time, he clearly saw some extremely wild stuff. Ra asserts that it wasn't pretty much blending beats. He purportedly attempted to blend him as well. In the event that you get my meaning, he discussed long stretches of unseemly way of behaving that he says he needed to tolerate on the grounds that he was working for Diddy. Better believe it, you all. Little Loot dropped a few serious claims about Diddy. He guaranteed that Diddy attempted to say him, and that there were little kids at Diddy's gatherings whose beverages were purportedly spiked, supposedly youthful. Miami was not too far off alongside him, seeing it in essence, didn't let a finger to help or stop Diddy's activities, and don't for a moment even get me began the case that Diddy supposedly may have had youthful Miami's however, cousin endeavor to say little pole. Fortunately, the cousin wasn't fruitful. Be that as it may, you all it gets more out of control, obviously since Pole additionally said that Diddy attempted to drive Cuba Gooding to say him too, it felt to bar like Diddy was attempting to groom him and even pimp him out to other men in the business. You all even Diddy's previous guardian John Bargain hopped into basically reinforcement Burr's cases I could see with an individual like Lil Bar. He likely was messing him up, snatching him, grabbing him, you understand what I'm talking about. Behaving like he playing with him, however he as a matter of fact maintained that he should do what he need him to do, so like I said before that he did in the past, so the heart's play was his approach to prepare. In you in the six, well I don't that preparing that is new, you understand what I'm talking about. We didn't call that we didn't call it prepping in those days, that his heart play was an approach to telling you I could truly hurt you, on the off chance that I needed to you get it, I could truly hurt you furthermore, that is what that kid likely felt ya, why he treating me so harshly, as that goodness he's simply playing with you, no, he was letting you know whether I turn this up I could truly hurt you it. That was his method of attempting to persuade you to be accommodating to him, right he's telling you he's placing to you tune in here brother, he's attempting to place to him. We're playing presently, however, to turn this on you, it's on you. Ain't got no successes, so that youngster is feeling you tuned. In here as per Lil Pole, when he attempted to call Dee Dee out on his frightening way of behaving, did he recently brushed it off as joking around comprising he now had nothing to do with anything evil and that pole was simply adding an excessive amount to it, bare guaranteed that Diddy even went as far as to straightforwardly recommendation, him promising to attach him with the title of Maker of the Year at the Grammys, however you all it gets, much more insane in light of the fact that Pole said that. Diddy made him watch recordings of Maker Stevie J getting into some truly compromising circumstances, like you know taking part in personal exercises with another fellow, and that is not all he asserted the. At Diddy's Miami Manor was the spot for some genuinely wild part parties, where a wide range of obscure stuff went down pole, even suspects that he could have been sedated and taken benefit of at one of those gatherings. Now I'm not expressing any of this is valid, but rather it's certainly dubious. Particularly since different ladies who sued Diddy had a few very much like cases the court record expressed honor about February 2nd, 2023, episode Mr. Jones trust Mr. Cole him Mr. Jones, awakened lighthead. Ed and confounded, he was in a bed with two S laborers and Mr. Brushes, he additionally reviews carelessly meandering around the house, with no garments on L pole, additionally name dropped one of the men that Diddy was attempting to pimp him out to, and it's none other than Cuba Gooding talking about. Cuba, however, TMZ announced that Jones claims Diddy acquainted him with Cuba Gooding Jr. on Diddy's yacht, and Cuba supposedly started contacting, roping, and petting Mr. Jones's legs, his upper internal thighs, his crotch the little of his back, close to his hindquarters, and his shoulders you all know Diddy's previous body. 
Jean Bargan additionally had a comment about Diddy in Cuba. He's likewise you realize an army that he met Cuban Gooden Jr. through Diddy on Did. And it even reached a place where he began contacting him on his, you know, upper internal thigh close to his gro as per him. Did you see the image? I didn't get to see it yet. Oh goodness my god, see you pay attention to me man. I couldn't say whether it was what they call it when you take two pictures and they set up it, use like that, they what they what they call it at the point when they set up the photos and it don't have a place together. Yet, they put it together whatever next to each other, no doubt anything they call that Klein a uh, wa Cuban Gooden jar was so near that man I would thought that was his woman. And this is the image that Jean was alluding to, and no doubt it looks very Sue's, since Jean likewise implied that. Diddy could have placed the thought in Cuba's head the little pole was new meat, so you seeing no photos. Do you accept his cases? No doubt I trust his cases. Someone put something in Cuban Gooding Jar ear that this was new meat or she might you at any point break him or see. Could you at any point do something coos? Don't no one else be that near? No, another man person for the for that reason? Come on, brother, that is insane. Truly the part about Cuba isn't that stunning, however, given his set of experience. Yes, he's been reputed to be a normal promotion these gatherings. And we as a whole understand what sort of ferocity goes down there when I notice Koopa's previous, I mean, he's confronted various allegations of acting improperly towards ladies, he's been blamed for article a bigger number of times than we can count, so it makes sense that he and Diddy are tight, you understand what they express similar creatures and all that chaotic stuff what's wild, however, is that Cuba used to have such an extraordinary profession in Hollywood back in the 90s. He begins a portion of our one motion pictures and uplifting films. At one point, he was in a real sense picking and picking jobs, and he cemented his place in the business by winning an Oscar for Best Supporting Entertainer in the 1996 film. Jerry Maguire currently individuals had their viewpoints on whether he merited that success. Yet toward the day's end, he still brought back home the honor that was that also. In the wake of winning the Oscar, Cuba was feeling like he was large and in charge. What's more, got excessively fastidious with his jobs, and truly he cat would stand to be anyway. His companion chief Cameron Crowe saw that Cuba was doing an excessive lot furthermore, offered him some strong guidance keeping up with great associations with chiefs and makers to remain pertinent in the game, yet did Cuba listen? No, he was all the while enjoying some real success on his Oscar win, and also decided to do things his own would prefer which ended up being quite possibly of absolutely awful choices of his profession. After his large win, Cuba had a surge of significant jobs to browse. However, some way or another, he wound up going with every one of some unacceptable decisions. He turned down driving jobs in films like In Rwanda. Amistad and security not to notice passing on lead in the hit film The Last Ruler of Scotland, as was what he in any event, thinking no not him being so particular and winding up picking some unacceptable thing, yet as indicated by Cuba, he turned down those jobs since he thought the characters were troublemakers and needed to stick to playing legends and didn't need his fans to see him in a negative light. Kitty Bye in the interim. Timberland Whitaker took the job of the last Lord of Scotland also, wound up winning an Oscar for it if just Cuba hadn't been so fixated on playing the legend he might have had one more Oscar when on his rack. However, as you can envision, Chiefs in the end got tired of his meticulousness and halted. Offering him moves out and out, however, to his credit, Cuba took ownership of his diva disposition and conceded that he had wrecked things up for himself during an interview with the gatekeeper he conceded. Did I had this large number of huge Chiefs off of me jobs, and I read their contents and said I don't think this part is appropriate for me also. What happens is assuming you outrage enough large chiefs, you get removed their list in a similar meeting, he conceded that he got snatched up by his Oscar. Admitting for me it was generally about safeguarding the holiness of that brilliant sculpture, since I believed I expected to show individuals that I can do more, I could do better, yet Cuba immediately undone. Ear stood that the Oscar won't take care of the bills in law, so he at last chose to drop his meticulousness and take any role he could get since he frantically required the cash by then. However, it was past the point of no return the offers simply weren't moving in like they used to the majority of the motion pictures he wound up in were average, best case scenario, and his exhibitions were average, so even however he had some work he was still attempting to recover financially then, at that point, I 
End 2016, things fired gazing upward for him when he handled the lead job of O.J. Simpson in the restricted series American Wrongdoing Story, Individuals vs. O.J. Simpson, he even got an Emmy selection for Remarkable Lead Entertainer in the Ministries or then again film, and it seemed like his vocation was refocusing yet similarly as he begun to hook right out of the Hollywood boycott. Subscribe Apple World for more videos.